Are you guys also using Windows 10 or Windows 11 and still you feeling your is related to security so it will secure your pc as well so just click on this fix and now it's automatically going to fix all these things and these all things you are going to do manually so this is going to fix it very easily by just one click Okay, so now you can see fix completed your current PC health status it's near to good and uh, because they already have paid version so that's why they can't show you complete good but it's still it is good for free right in free version you are getting optimized very easily just click on back button just click on finish and here you can see manual mode and AI mode so we are in AI mode currently just switch to manual mode so you can select all and uh, it will automatically optimize all things or you can manually do it it is good to have all things okay so it will optimize your complete pc in just one click right and here you can see speed up your pc is not at its top performance so here you can see turbo boost stop unnecessary program to release ram and boost your pc so you need to turn it on so you can see you getting work mode game mode and economy mode so whenever you click on game mode then definitely it will optimize your pc for gaming purposes just click on turn on and it will boost your pc in a just one click now you can see 520 mb rams are just free 45 program just stopped and here you can see startup optimizer click on optimize all these things are going to start up but i just use this vmware so i'm not going to do it but i'm going to stop these two things okay so just click on optimize and here you can see startup items or services and the schedule tasks basically you need to check one by one what you need to stop or what you need to enable 
enable and disable right and all the startup items whatever you getting from this task manager and that will show you here here you're going to startup section and some things are like you can see cortana is enabled just right click and disable it and here you can see disable it so the things you want to disable which you don't want to start on a startup just right click and disable it and this will definitely going to boost your system to next level here you can see app slash extension and cleaner 13 extension are found install i bought and install it to uninstall the unnecessary and smoother browsing just click on install this will give you this uninstaller of extension but yeah you can go to your chrome and uh, do it manually so you can see some pro versions are here like real time tune up monitor and optimize system resources in real time a smoother pc performance monitor is still on in free version but auto ram cleaner in pro version so their pro version is also here like uh, activate is $16 per month but uh, I would suggest use this free one if you like it then you can use the pro version as well okay so go into protection so you can see anti spyware is off because it is in pro version but most of the thing you will get here like uh, email protection just turn it on add removal just click here and it will give you some extension to add it you can see 2 lakh users are using it just click on add and add extension it will remove ads from your chrome browser here you can see software updater so currently in my case it is showing all software are up to date action center so here they have like uh, vpn services or screen recorder you can install it and driver updater so whatever the thing you like here just click on install and it will install and you can see for gamers there is a game booster it will increase your fps right i think this is a great or very good utility for windows users so at the top you can see RAM RAM 29% whenever you click on this clean RAM it will clean your RAM you need to click on this uh, navigation arrow and all things will be showing here like RAM whatever the programs open in your system that will be showing here and here you can see clean RAM so it will clean up your RAM and here you can see scan so it will automatically scan from here you don't need to open your software manually so you can see CPU usage so whatever the CPU uses here currently it is working perfectly fine so that's why it is not showing anything here there is a disk uses okay so that's how you can use it and optimize your system for your performance okay so use it and